Mr. Fender Bender. Well, say there, Pit Pit. I mean, Putt Putt. Haven't seen you in ages. I stopped by to say hi. And I was also wondering if you wanted me to recycle your empty bottles. Well, I've been meaning to recycle it myself. Haven't gotten around to it, so by all means, take it. Thanks. I will. Someone was littering. I think I'll pick up this empty bottle and recycle it. Wow! A coin! Hot ziggity! A bottle! <laughs> What was that I ran over? Well, who knows, because I can't see a thing. Wow, it's a flashlight. Hey, Pot, but you want that old thing? It's not really working. You know what's wrong with it, Torble? Oh, yeah. No batteries. Go ahead and take it. Gee, thanks. Oh, don't you go mentioning it now. I need to be on the lookout for the veggies for Mr. Baldini. I still need to find a tomato, an ear of corn, and a bunch of broccoli. I wonder if I can get close enough to reach that. Look, broccoli! I need some of those for Mr. Baldini. I better pick some. one of those for Mr. Baldini. I think I'll pick it. Tomatoes! I've got to get some for Mr. Baldini. I better pick some. That's it. I filled the box. Now I have to take it back to Mr. Baldini.
I got at the toy store will fit in this. Perfect! It's a hook! That's a dangerous thing to have in the road. I better pick it up. But you are a great pal. Why don't you hook it back on me and I'll get these pipes moved. Thanks, Putt Putt. Okay, stand back. I've got work to do. All clear. Thanks again, Putt Putt. It sure feels great to be able to work again. You're welcome, Pete. Recycling? Of course not. It's all yours. Thanks. I'll have a carton of milk, please, Rover. Freshest you'll find anywhere, Putt Putt. Coming right up. There you go. Thanks. What do I owe you? Are you kidding? I owe you. I mean, you're the guy who brought me back from the moon. It's free to you, Putt Putt. Always. Gee, Rover, that's really nice. That's really cold. Thanks, Rover. I think I'll save it for later. Hi, Mr. Crankcase. Hey, 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 Pat Pat. Excuse me, Mr. Crankcase. This sure is an awfully big mess. Whew. You're telling me? accidentally bumped into those shelves this morning and nearly twisted my lug nuts. I can hardly bend over to put all that stuff back on the shelf. Oh, don't worry. I can put it back for you. You do that and I'd be more tickled than a newly tuned turbo engine. Have to warn you, though. There's only one way everything fits. Stuff was packed in there pretty darn tight. Okay, Mr. Crankcase. I'll remember that. Mr. Crankcase. Thanks for letting me help. No, thank you. You're the one who needs to be thanked. You're very welcome, Mr. Crankcase. 